Hey guys, Tony the Soy Sass Assassin. Welcome to another episode of Cigar Review. And today we're doing a revisit, technically, because you know, whenever I I I, I review a cigar and you know um and, and and I say it was bad, and then it went on somebody's list for like number one, number two, number three, and it's like Tony, you're a D-bag, you don't know what you're talking about. Blah 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 blah. So I go, you know what? I will go buy it, that specific size, and I'll smoke it. And then we'll see if it's bad again. All right? So this is what we're going to do. Put this ashtray to the side in case I knocked it all over. <clears throat> Today we're doing the Johnny Tobacco Knot in the Perfecto size, which is the one that I think went number three in the uh, half wheel or whatever. So I wanted to collect the box anyway, so I might as well buy it. I procrastinated for a while. So this is what you get if you buy the Perfecto size. And the Perfecto size inside, actually each one is individual wrapped. Very typical of um, the style that Room 101 has been doing with their special edition stuff. So. Anyway, take one out, show it to you, how this look like. And let's go with uh, with the, some, some data. All right, so Johnny Tobacana, 6x56, Vitola is Perfecto. Uh, this one, I think MSRP is $16 roughly. And this is the outside of the cover. Yeah. And now with the inside. Closed. Closed. Gold band. Room 101. Not too ugly. Rappers, Ecuadorian, Connecticut, C shade grown. And binder is Mexican. And filler is Nicaraguan. All right. So let's get right to it and see what this is about really seriously we just need to get over with all right so let's get this over with once and for all let's see if it's good inside it's not like paper totally useless so i just gotta put it outside box you know what i might as well put that back in there there you go shove it in there boom close never to see it again ashtray coffee if you didn't listen to uh our podcast it's all about routine it's all about having a setup right so before i start clean everything up make sure it has set up now we're ready to smoke uh it really just smells woodsy All right, let's go. I give this the best chance possible. I received this. I waited a week. I let it sit in a really humidified, nice environment. This have to be the best possible chance this thing has. <coughs> wow. Okay. Hmm. 
Pwet, 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 pwet. More bits. Jesus Christ. Is this like mixed filler? Tastes like a mixture between a barnyard and graham cracker of some sort. Let's go. A little bit bitterness. Mineral, a lot of mineral. Oh. Yeah, medicine bitterness. There's a bitterness, there's mineral, there's almost like a cereal, but bitter cereal. And very sharp cedar. All right, fine. Uh, we'll let it burn one third. I'll be right back. Okay. Um, one third. It tastes like. Mineral, graham cracker, a little bit sweet, and a lot of nothingness. Yeah, it's something like it tastes like something's there, but it's not really there. I don't know. There, there, there's not much going on in one third. That's how I taste. So, and it burns pretty quickly. Like this thing is almost half. So, I don't know. All right, I'll smoke another third <laughs> and I'll be back because I don't know what you said. I, I guess it tastes slightly better than the other one, but it's not that. Be right back. All right, second third. I, I want to say that, you know, after the first third, it kind of get a little bit better. And then right away, it got worse. Like it got a little bit better. It got sweeter. It almost got like honey kind of taste to it and grain cracker. It's got sweeter. And then all of a sudden now there's like a weird sour taste to it that I don't know. I don't want to, I don't know if you call it citrus or. I don't know if you call it citrus, licorice or barnyard. And some of the puff. Has a little hint of ammonia. And not to mention, look at look at this leaf. Right? Look okay, right? Look here. Look. What is this? Valley cured tobacco. That's disappointing. But anyways, I think the band is pretty much the same as the other one. Um really this is not worth to. It's just, it's the same. The perfecto did not have a band that's different. So there's nothing to it, nothing to it. But yeah, last uh, hope this is getting better, but it, I don't know. We are back. All right, last bit. I need to go back and watch what the hell I, I say about this cigar. Cause like, I feel like I'm about to rate this so bad that's worse than the first one. So I'm smoking the line where that is like under fermented. It tastes nasty. Right before that, it kind of have a little bit of sweetness, a lot of mineral, a lot of mineral, like metal, and um, and 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 sweetness. I like and and a little bit of ammonia, a little bit of honey, maybe bread, maybe bread. And a little bit of licorice sweetness. And once you get to that line, that line has this really weird, nasty bitterness to it. Like, I don't even know what it is. 
Yeah. So, why would I rate this cigar? I'm gonna say this is A. Definitely not number three. This is just a smokable cigar. I'm gonna rate it six dollars to six dollar fifty ish. It's smokable. It's interesting. The bend is cool. The packaging is cool, but that's pretty much it. Like, I didn't enjoy it. I, I can't wait for this thing to finish. Maybe a little bit barnyard too. And, and that's all I got. I did not understand why people like this so much. I can understand that people will taste the sweetness and and that's one of those things I feel like is double-edged swords. Like once you know what you don't like, you actually will taste that what you don't like a lot more because you will realize that it's there. And for me, I realize it's there so that every time I smoke it, I'm going to notice it more. But yeah, it's just a smokable cigar. It's normal cigar. It's like, I don't know, bundle cigar wrap up in a, in a nicer package kind of thing. I, I don't see why this is... I don't see why this is number three. I don't know. I don't. I don't. I don't. But... Yeah, if you're collecting it, like the box, then yeah, sure. Six dollar, six fifty, maybe six fifty, because I got the box now. So I, I will give it another fifty cents for the box. Ah, oh, it's so bitter. Yeah, so that's it for this review. If you like it, make sure to like, subscribe, comment share yeah i'm interested in what i said last time so maybe i had to i don't know maybe did i improve cannot be if i give it six dollars i got a six dollar six fifty that's not really improved i don't know i had to i had to go back and review what i what i just said so when i when i edit this but anyways that's it for the review i'll see you guys in the next video hopefully it's better I don't really like to do reviews and this one is one of those things like why tone why you know so i'll see you guys next one bye guys